98, 99, 100. Soft. Aww. How's it going everybody? Jared here from Smoking Android again. Um, just wanted to bring you a quick little video to show you proof of why it's a good idea to root your device. I don't care what kind of device you have, as long as somebody has been able to root it, I strongly recommend you do so. And uh, here's why. Alright, so, um, the other day I decided to take a screenshot, actually a couple of the screenshots of um, the battery life that uh, I had since charged. And again, this is one of many reasons why you should root your device. But one of the biggest issues people have is battery life on their device. And in fact, um, I get a lot of questions after I review ROMs, um, you know, asking about the battery life, this, that, and the other. Now, just for your information, I am running new. Uh, well, this is the Motorola Atrix, and I'm running um, Neutrino ROM version 2.7. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like. If I can find the screenshot, I think this, no, that's not it. Oh, there it is. All right, check this out. I'll zoom in here for you guys. So that one's nothing too special, but um, six hours and 51 minutes, and it was charged to 99% before I unplugged it. And so basically six hours for 10% of battery life. Um, you know, I check my emails, text messages, phone calls, browse the internet, and my Wi-Fi is on 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I never turn it off, ever, 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 ever. Um, the next one we got here went for one day, eight hours, and I still had 35% battery left. The next time I took the screenshot, it was one day, 18 hours, 15% battery left. And then this was the really impressive one. Um, this is one uh, a day that I had been testing out some different apps to review, um, tons of emails, couple of phone calls, tons of text messages, lots of web browsing, and I believe I'd actually flashed two or three ROMs um, in the process, like while still unplugged. Um, you know, except for pushing the files to the device. Um, <laughs> Two days, seven hours, and I was at 29%. That is crazy. Um, so that was two hours, two days, seven hours. This is two days, 16 hours, and I went down to 19%. That was still sort of on the same battery charge. Um, so two days, 16 hours, and that is the best I've had for a little while now. But um, that just goes to show, you know, what flashing a good custom ROM can do for your device. And you know, and I use the crap out of my device now. If I was playing a game, you know, forever, then you know, for a couple of hours, then you'd probably see the battery diminish a lot quicker. But for you know, average day-to-day -day usage, text messages, emails, phone calls, web browsing, YouTube, a game for, you know, 15 minutes here and there when you're waiting, you know, just waiting around or something like that. Um, this is the type of performance I got out of my battery. And this is what happens when you flash a well-built custom ROM. And of course, the only way you can flash a well-built custom ROM is by rooting your device. So, this is, in my opinion, a huge, huge reason why you should root your device. Everybody's always complaining about battery life. Well, there's something you can do about it. So, um, yeah, that's uh, that's basically it, guys. Uh, give this video a thumbs up, and make sure you subscribe for more videos. Not like this one, but for other ones. <laughs> and uh, stay tuned. We'll be looking at a couple of ROMs that um, I haven't gotten around to yet for the Motorola Atrix. So for those of you Motorola Atrix users, uh, stay tuned today. I will be releasing, I think, another one or two videos today, depending on uh, how busy I get. Um, so anyways, yep, Jared for the Smoking Android, signing out. Peace.